Benjamin had three beautiful children, Emily, Michael, and Sarah, whom he loved dearly. However, unbeknownst to everyone, Benjamin carried a heavy burden, a secret that weighed on his heart and mind every single day. You see, Benjamin had been divorced from his wife, Olivia, for several years now. The divorce had not been amicable, and Benjamin had been ordered to pay child support to Olivia to ensure his children's well-being. At first, it seemed like a fair arrangement, as Benjamin was determined to provide for his children, even if it meant compromising his own comfort. But as time went by, Benjamin's financial situation took a turn for the worse. His business, once thriving, began to decline, leaving him struggling to make ends meet. The weight of the mounting debt and the constant fear of not being able to fulfill his obligations began to take a toll on Benjamin's mental state. He would often lie awake at night, staring at the ceiling, his mind consumed by worry. He felt trapped in a cycle of despair, torn between his love for his children and his inability to meet the court-ordered payment. The weight of the guilt and shame he carried became unbearable, leading him down a dark path of depression. To make matters worse, Benjamin's friends and neighbors were unaware of his struggles. They saw a man who worked tirelessly, always putting on a brave face, but little did they know the storm that brewed inside him. Benjamin couldn't bring himself to share his pain, fearing judgment or pity. As the days turned into weeks and the weeks into months, Benjamin found solace in the deep forests that surrounded his town. There, he would take long walks, seeking refuge from the crushing weight of his secret. The trees became his confidants, listening intently to his whispered words of despair, offering a sense of tranquility that was otherwise elusive. One day, while lost in the depths of his despair, Benjamin stumbled upon an old, forgotten journal. Its pages were yellowed with age, but its words were filled with wisdom, hope, and redemption. The journal belonged to an anonymous individual who had faced similar struggles, and their words resonated deeply with Benjamin. Emboldened by the stories he read, Benjamin realized that he needed to confront his fears and seek help. He mustered the courage to confide in a trusted friend 